Welcome to the Garden State, New York's kid brother. Never big enough or good enough. Being small isn't a handicap here. Does this look like the place where the answer can be found? You know, if you're from here, you're either tough or you think you're tough. Most likely you think you're tough, you know, and not everybody's that tough. You know, a lot of kids would end up scrapping because of that. You know, a lot of his friends were taller and bigger, and he was smaller. I'm sure some kids may got picked on a little bit and they just put their head down and walk away. I, I wouldn't do that. You know, I would stand up for myself, and uh, you know, that would cause me into having to, to defend myself at times. Frankie is a scrapper. He was the little guy, he would get picked on. He never started the fight, but he would always finish it. Go, Frankie, go! It's always the big guys, too. They, they see this little guy, they're trying to impress a girl, so they would pick on him, and then they would end up with their arm, like, behind their back on the ground. He never would give up. He, that's his attitude, never giving up. And I'm, I'm sure if you've seen his fights, <laughs> you'll know he just is not a quitter. Switching stances is that oh, oh, I feel very comfortable here. You know, when I went to college, uh, it was a culture shock, you know, from New Jersey Shore to Western PA. I really kind of started uh, training pretty much as soon as I got home from college. I knew as soon as I got home, I was gonna, I wanted to, you know, train, you know, mixed martial arts, BJJ, all that kind of stuff, learn, learn boxing and whatnot. And um, I found a place right away, it's a local place, and I started training. Buddy out of Tom's River, New Jersey, Frank! The fighting is what he does, it's not who he is. Being a dad is, uh, it's unbelievable, you know, um, it's, uh, it's life changing, obviously for the better. Mom, you need a bagel? Huh? Oh, fruit. Yeah. Yeah, fruit. You know, sometimes I have to travel and stuff, so it's hard being away from your kids, but, uh, Coming here, you know, the older they're getting, the more fun it is, and uh, you know, I learn a lot from them too. So it, it's been, uh, it's been a hell of an experience so far. He, he's a good dad. He's definitely a good dad. He's always been like this great, warm presence. I know. I don't want. You can eat it now, right? I just want my kids to say, looking at some past fights, like, wow, my dad was a gritty dude. He wasn't scared of anybody. He was always willing to put hard work in, and uh, and he went after it. He wasn't afraid to chase his dreams. Frankie Edgar, he may be, you know, small, but you're not gonna mess with him because he will kick your butt. As you could tell, he loves being from Tom's River. You That's know? what he shouts out at the end of May, you know. Tom's River. I mean, River this baby. is his town. He loves it. You hear like rappers talk about Brooklyn or LA and stuff like that. You know, I don't live in a big city like that, but I'm gonna rep my town, you know. This town kind of made me, so I feel like I gotta, you know, shout it out. TR baby, bring it a bell where it belongs.